Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, looks like we're back for another exciting stream and happy Monday to all you beautiful people out there. So glad to see y'all. See y'all. All of y'all. All, all y'all. Yeah. Y'all doing good? Happy Monday. Yep, yep, yep. Monday. Monday, we're gonna we're gonna make this day a good day. All right. It's all about mindset. Getting in there. Don't let them don't let them mess with your head. You know? Yeah. That's it. Let's get in here. Baldur's Gate 3. We're at the end of Act 2. Going into Act 3. See what we got. Any button to continue? Going to load game. See what we got. Where are we at? No, that was the last character I was playing. Here we go. Campsite. Boom. Boom. Shadow cursed lands have been uncursed. The only Monday I'm happy about because I'm off work all week. <laughs> nice. Very nice. Very nice. How much? Yakshamash. Ugh. Okay, here we are. At camp. Woot. All right, cool. Let's see. Fine, familiar. Let's pull, pull out. Pull out. Pull out. My imp, because I love imps. Okay, so we have that, that, that. Uh. Okay, so there's that. There's everybody's thing there. Okay, got that. That, I don't need to talk to anybody, right? Oh, nope, I gotta go talk to her. What does she want? It would be nice. I've been lied to. My whole life. And I was gullible enough to just believe it. My parents are alive and I have to save them. I think a part of me always knew that. A part that Shah denied to me. Hmm. Uh, dare I suggest Char may have had her reason. You've been forced to live a lie. At least now the truth is starting to reveal itself. You have a lot in your mind, but we have to focus. The absolute is still a threat. Uh, forced to live a lie. At least now the truth is starting to reveal itself. Indeed. <clears throat> the truth may yet prove painful. Who knows what yeah. Char still keeps from me. We'd better press on for now and hope we're ready when the moment comes. But before that, there's one thing I need to see to. Uh, should I be concerned? You'll see for yourself soon enough. Just leave it with me. Uh, okay, cool. Oh, I gotta pet the owl bear before I set off. Talk. Hmm, get him. Oh, I can need to speak with animals. I gotta put the potion on. Another step forward. Okay. Uh, any elixirs, potions, all that stuff there I need to put on. Bark skin. Mmm, fire resistance, dark vision, battle mage, three, three arcane acuity. Right, but how long does that stay on? Hold on. Plus one bonus to its spell, attack rolls and difficulty class for each remaining turn. Does that last all day? Battle Mage's power. Hold on. I'm going to quick save right quick. Pop this potion. If it doesn't last all day, I'm going to... Three turns remaining. So it's useless.
Or wait, hold on. It should have. Reduce the duration by time each time the eternity's hit. Condition three turns remaining. I'm at camp, so it's not going to trigger down. Gotcha. Okay, so let me reload. I could jump. Saves coming over here. I know, I know, right? I know, I know. Relax, relax. It's fine. It's fine, Chad. It's fine. Uh. Okay. That said, let me look. Are there any other good elixirs I want? Catherick's Netherstone. No. Power resistance, guileful movement. Cannot be paralyzed or restrained. Lightning resistance, necrotic resistance, poison, sea invisibility, don't need it. Colossus, Tiefling's Vice, Viciousness, Oil of Accuracy, Oil of Bane, there. Well, I need either Peerless Focus or. circle of bones nope I need to give this to Asterion yeah put this up at camp Send a lot of this stuff to camp. Hold on. There's just so much crap you can get in this game. Exhort the Risen. Subjugate the undead with your commands. Ghoulish touch. Paralyze the target for two turns. Elves and undead cannot be paralyzed. It does not require concentration. Um, her, I guess, maybe. Supreme Elixir of Arcane Cultivation, a level four spell slot. I don't even have level four spells, so that'd be used for somebody else. In that case, sheesh. Alchemy patch. How much is this? Weighing 13. That's 13 pounds too. Keychains 55. Okay, cool. Um, I don't have any elixir for myself. In that case, let me H herbalism extract ingredients. Don't have it. elixirs. Heroism, viciousness. Greater, uh, and he's superior. Galpha movement, bark scan, viciousness, maybe heroism, Pegasus feathers. No, viciousness. That's just what I say. Mephid magma, fire ember. That might be good here. Craft, craft one. Coatings. Okay, nothing. Here, just go and craft another one. Grenades. Nope. Potions. All right, animal speaking and my reading. Subjugate tongue of madness. I would not be using the tap boy elixir, so that's fine.
All right, I or by type to lust bloodlust. Give that to Carlac. After him, draw poison, even though he doesn't use them most of the time, which is fine. I'm going to use this on her. Two attack rolls. Does that include spell attack rolls? Dice roll that determines whether an attack hits a target. So it's it's got to be on a melee. It's got to be on weapon attacks. Okay, you take that. You take that. Well, that's useless now. Wait, no, maybe it's not. The item is only functional on the Gauntlet of Shar, so I never used it, so it's gone now. Awesome. Vampiric Touch. Siphon the Life Force. Hey, that's a good one that I give to Asterion. Okay. Right, right, all right. Okay, should be good. I am going to get out of here. All right, what other elixir should I put on? She is getting bloodlust, right? Elixir of bloodlust. Yeah, I'm gonna save it and hold on to it, Careful. just in case. All right, let's go. Let's go. I know, right? I know. Uh, right now, it's kind of boring. I'm going through inventory and try to, like, optimize everything here. Uh, that's the only bad thing about games like this. Is just, there's there's these long, drawn-out, tedious moments. Especially when you got inventory management. And the management system for inventory is crap. So, hold on. Uh, organized by type. Elixir of Vigilance. I'm gonna save that as well, just in case. So I'm ready. Whatever it takes. Do it oil of accuracy. Boom, boom, boom. Dalzic ring marrow. It's part of games though. That or farming. Oh yeah. Yeah, I play Stardew Valley for a little while. It's literally nothing but farming. <laughs> gotcha. All right, cool. What does she have on her that's actually good for? Her? Yeah, some of this is crap. That staff, though, that blesses OP. Mm, I've been wanting to hold on to it and do something with it at least. Here, give these to Carlac. Okay, cool. And a whole person, good. All right, I need to exit camp. Leave camp. Where am I at? Yeah, unless it's boss farming. Then you just have constant boss fights back to back. Depending on the boss, too. Some boss fights, it, once they become so repetitive, it, they just become boring. Take it to Stardew again. I can't wait to be back <laughs> Good. Stardew is not a bad game. I like it. Uh, where do I need to go? What's what's my objective? Hold on. Get Gortash, get Orin's Nether Stone, rescue the Grand Duke, take him to Baldur's Gate. So I guess the whole deal. Baldur's Gate. So my whole deal is to go to Baldur's Gate. That is my next deal. Go to Baldur's Gate. Gortash is in Baldur's Gate. Okay, play to Frontiers. Asset turned out to Missouri herself, blah, blah, blah. She disappeared again, but not before promising she'd find us soon enough. Oh, okay. And then Wizard of Waterdeep. That's for Mysterion. <laughs> I 
don't be like me and ignore raids and chat. Oh, I got you. Yeah, I try to keep up with it. My biggest deal is sometimes OBS likes to be weird and not turn the volume on for raids or my notifications in general. So somebody would follow and I completely miss it because I just didn't hear the sound notification. And so <laughs> it had to make sure constantly make sure that OBS has a sound outputting to my headphones or to my speakers, depending on if I'm streaming on my PlayStation or not. So, but yeah, I get that. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Pay for somebody to stream when we could do it for free. To be fair, OBS is powerful. It's just that the settings for devices for your video output and your, your sound, sometimes I like to switch up and switch off. So it is what it is. It's fine. It's minor stuff, though. All right, cool. So Baldur's Gate going to Baldur's Gate. That's what I need to do, which means I need to pull up the map. I need to go over here. Where's the closest? No, it doesn't matter. I'm literally right out the front door. Let me go right here. We leave the heart of the absolute alive. Thanks to you. You did well to defeat Ketherick, but Ketherick was only the first to fall. There are many more battles ahead, and they will not be so easily won. You will need allies. Yeah, free is free is always a good thing. You can't be free. Uh, let's see. They already have allies. You need allies. I already have allies. I know. That's why I just recruited your hero. Just recruit Allison. Uh, enough lives have been lost. I don't want to send others to their deaths. I don't need allies. I have you. I technically already have allies. I know that's recruited to hear. Wisdom will be an asset to you on the journey ahead. Her harpers too. Halcyon's strength and loyalty will bolster you in times of need. But if we are to succeed. We will need others. Like who? Who do you have in mind? Mysterious person from the far realm beyond to the astral planes? Mm. Uh, when we arrive in the city, uh, I will seek more allies in the city. Now think about it. I will build an army to rival that of the Absolute. We'll seek more allies in the city. Good. I'm glad to hear that. Baldur's Gate may not know it yet. But its fate is bound to ours. Wait. Seek on its streets those whose purpose aligns with our own and invite them to our cause. Together, we will put an end to the absolute, the chosen, all. I just realized. Let's move. Why it was pulling up Shadowheart. In. Because A, she probably has. Hold on. Wits and blades always sharp. She was the last one I was controlling. So, uh, where is it at? Did it put it in my inventory? Still breathing. Despite it did. It did. Hold on. Where's it at? The artifact. Yeah, it's right there. It's a, it's a D twenty. Uh. Where is? Hold on. Waste. Okay, cool. You. I need aid at fifth level. Fifth level. Confirm. An extra 20 HP across the board. Not bad. Alright. There. Now here. Uh, here, here, here. Now here. Let's go. All right, where to? Where am I going? I need to go. That was the pub. I need to go over here.
Oh shh. Failed to kill you. I won't make the same mistake. How many are there? Four? Where's the fourth one? Hold on. There's that one. No, wait, no. There's three up top and there's two up bottom, so there's five total. Okay, Karlak, here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna have you run over here. Well, well. To this one. Attack. Um, attack again. How are you only doing five damage? How did you only do five damage? Reckless, of course. Uh, no, don't do worry about. Here, rage. I should have raged beforehand, but oh well. In turn, you. I'm gonna go over here. Poison that one. Can't reach destination, but I can melee attack. Go, go do that, and take that hit. Uh, this game's pathfinding sometimes is just ridiculous. There. Okay, cool. You come over here since this one's getting all the deal on it. And we're going to sneak attack. Boom, go. How are y'all missing? I don't understand why y'all are missing. So much. In turn. Another fight. Cool. Let's go. X. Um, uh, what is your weakest stat? Okay, it's gonna be wisdom across the board for all of them. Okay, well, intelligence, but wisdom is quicker to click on. And now I, boom, boom, and boom. No. Uh, no, and no. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. All right, number one over here. With haste. Then in turn. What do we got? Yes, shield. Shadow heart. Run up and beat the shit out of this one. God damn, why do you suck so hard? Yeah, this seems like a big fight. Let me go ahead and get one of these out. Oh. Okay, cool. Wait, did she just Eldrick blast somebody? Uh, yes, Warcaster. Hey, did they wet? How is it? Why? Why do you have to keep attacking Asterion? There, just attacking. All right, what do you have left? Okay, cool. In turn. Carlac. Uh, go. Reckless, of course. Then attack again. There. Boom. All right, enter. That's fine. Really? That's it? Hold on. Do I still have... Let me pick that up. Where are your other weapons? There. Pick that one up, too. Pick it up. Okay. Shh. 
Sheesh. I don't care. You just need to do one damage. There. Perfect. Uh. Alright, in turn. Life comes easy these days. Who do I need to hit? I need to reapply this. Wisdom. is interrupted. How? Oh, there we go. Hit him in the head. Okay. Enter. Asterion. How? How are you this week? I don't get it. I don't understand at all. First level, let's go. We're doing what this one. How how is the path interrupted? It's literally right there. Hit him in the head. How about that one? Can you hit that one? No. Because you're stupid. Okay, there, go. Perfect. Perfection. Here, heal everybody. Swear to God. Asterion is retarded. Mm, did I hellish rebuke? Yes. Elemental affinity, resistance. Spell deals damage, match a draconic esser. You can gain resistance to the damage type. Wait, wait, hold on. What? When you cast a spell that deals damage matching your draconic ancestry, I can spend one sort I've already I'm a tiefling, I'm already resistant to it. That reminds me, I need to change that. Okay. That's cool. We're going to fly. I don't have enough movement to get up here. What? This game. Just go like right there. I'll figure it out next turn. Um, really doesn't want you going anywhere. Yeah, I know. Here, not enough space. Can I jump up here? I can. Fuck that guy. That's one hell of a vertical leap. And then I hit again. And that should be it. Bonus act. I used a bonus action to jump, so that's no bueno. Okay. Asterion, I need you to figure out how to get all the fucking way up here because you can't jump there, but you can. Let's see. Can we get over here? That's 103 feet. Can I get up here? No, but I can range attack. Um, maybe sneak attack him. On her? Yeah, let's go. 
perfect. There. All right, let's. The hell is that barricade? Nothing. I'm going underneath here. Intern. Can't even catch my breath. There. Who am I hitting? Path is interrupted. That's the one I'm concentrating on, right? One. Uh, no, I'm going to save that. No, hold on. No, no, stop. Move over here. Find a way forward. Now let's do this. OK, can I hit this one? There and then hit this one there and then hit her. Boom. So that was two out of three. All right, cool. Um, I don't really need to do anything else except reapply hex. So let me get over here if I can. Can I reapply hex? Why do I need no target? Hold on. Can I get this way? Not gonna reapply it. No, I can't. Damn it. Oh, well, let us. That's per short rest. Yeah, let me do this. Three meters, not enough movement. I can't misty step over here because I don't have line of sight. That's fine. Go right there. All right, now in turn. <laughs> Do this and yeah, it got him bolt. That's fine. Enter. Did you just fucking? She's doing Elder Blast on two targets. Counter spells, a third level. Oh, it is a third level spell. Fuck your Elder Blast. Oh, it's this thing. Okay, cool. Here, fly, fly. Can I go over there? No, I can't. Are you are you fucking kidding me? Uh, that's fine. Here, Carla, just jump on her. Jimmy on the go. Yep, there we go. Come right there. <gasps> no, I can't get down there. That's nah, fine. Here, attack her from range. Go. Then do it again. Eh, good enough. Better to do a no damage. Time for a couple. Uh, cutting action dash. Don't linger. <gasps> Wait. She doesn't have. <laughs> I need to equip his goddamn weapons. What I need to do. Uh, we'll see a conditional on that. When they still have all their hit points now. 
Wait, no, that one needs to go up front. God damn it. <sighs> Stand in my way. Is this it? There. Here. Wisdom. Go there. Boom. Go. What do we got? Gonna be a lurky turkey. Gotcha. Gotcha. Lurkers make up the backbone of Twitch, so I don't mind at all. Alright, enter. Ready. Of course she's way the fuck over here. Let's Go. do this. Wait. Man, get the fuck out of here. I just hit I just hit a stereo while he's on the ground. Because I thought it was her. Oh my god. Oh well. R Ripperoni. It's not like he was any good anyways. Here, I can't even heal him if I wanted to. Come on. Over here? Yeah, come on up here. We know you're not the biggest fan of him, but damn. Yeah, I know. Fucking guiding bolt right in his back. Hold on. Here we go. Can I? No, because I can't see any of those, so I can't heal him. So that's going to be a waste. All right, enter. Do I want to counter spell? No, I don't want to counter spell. What is he doing? Is she doing Eldritch Blast? Well, now he's dead. Oh, well. And this bitch has been slowly trying to get away from this goddamn sword over here. This great axe has just been flying toward her. Fine. Fine. <laughs> like, <laughs> it's starting later. Bro, what the fuck? <laughs> like, you wanted to punish him. Just say that. I mean, I do have that dog collar I could put on him. I don't think he'd like it too much, but I have it. Carlac, here. You run your bitch ass down here. Soldier. And smack the shit out of this fucker. Like this, mate. Reckless. <laughs> and of course the same thing again. Go. Planet detector alerted us to the Githyanki attack. Looks like Voss was good for his word. <sighs> now, come down way. here. Where are my items? Where's my scrolls? I can't. There they are. There's that. Resurrect his bitch ass. Come over here. Why can't you take a hit? I mean, what's your what's your AC at, huh? Well, hello. Eighteen. Eighteen. Why why are you getting hit so much? I don't understand. I don't understand why you are taking so many damn hits. I know why. I know why. He's a bitch. Okay. So... I... Hold on. he definitely like it. Yeah, he would like that dog collar. Uh, now? here. I I mean I'm I'm barely done anything. Looking ahead. I don't even know why I would be needing to oh, take a long meal. rest right now. Or is it not a long rest, a short rest. Can't afford to stay idle. No, yeah, I've used up all my channel divinities. Let me let me take a short rest. Just one. I know. I just got here. It's fine. Nothing else is pressing, so I can take as many long I'll rests as I way. need. All's well that ends. Not as bad as it could have. There, go. Woof. 
click in Mage Hand, you can cast Mage Hand as a bonus action. And Telekinesis. Huh, not bad. Psionic Ward Armor. It's medium. The text aware is a gift. They have resistance to psychic damage. Saving throw, they regain one one to four hit points. Hmm. And royal orders. And a divine bone shard. What are the royal orders? Do what has been asked of you. Stop the interlopers. Take back what is mine. Else your punishment will be sever. Or severe. Sever. <laughs> severe. By order of your queen. Uh, she's a... Nope. She's, she's terrible anyway, so it doesn't matter. Um... Yeah, hold on. All of this needs to go... Needs to go to her. Alright, where's everybody else at? Here, you come here. Oh, honey ham? Ooh, ham. And the rest of this can go to Karlak. Breathe deep and move. Wait, no, hold on. I got two more to get. Hey, what's in here? I don't think I've ever explored this little house. I have it. Veterinary log. Uh, oh, it's a vet's log. Better not be cursed. Wait, not up there. Down here. Yes, pick up all the mushrooms. Stop running in front of everything because you want somebody to talk to you. I am sorry your soul life is like that pathetic. Get the Yankee crossbow, hand crossbow, uh, oil of <laughs> diminution, diminution, whatever that is. Garlic. God, now everything's dark around here. That's fine. Come on down. The shadow curse will soon be forgotten. Thanks to us. Looks like an army launched through here. To Baldur's Gate. Once you move on, hold on. Save game. Make a new save. Just in case. There. Just in case. <laughs> Continue on. Yes. The curse has been lifted. The land's cleansed of the shadows. Catherick's reign of living death is over. Your courage has been tested, and in this at least, you have triumphed. Nice. All that hard work paid off. Wait, is that the gift Daniel was talking about? I want a refund. I, I mean, I could use something that makes me more powerful or gold. Beauty is only skin deep.
Sergeant, if you are here, I presume Wern's Rock is secure, and preparations for my inauguration are complete. No, Lord Gortash. We were interrupted. Another quake in the lower city. More severe this time. So you came cowering to my chambers? I'm flattered, Sergeant. But even I cannot command natural phenomena to cease. Forgive me, my lord, but there is panic in the streets. The people are afraid. Perhaps the people would be calm if you kept your nerve. I expect better from the flaming fist than to run scared from a slight tremor in the earth. Get back to your duties. Duties, duties, duties. Patrolling and saluting and following and bowing and scraping. Yes, sir. No, sir. Rip and cut your throat, sir. Your plan is falling apart, Lordling. Give me a reason not to cut you to ribbons. Control yourself, Orin. We need to focus on reuniting the stones or the brain will break free. These quakes are just the start. Neither of us expected the prison bearers to kill Ketherick. They'll be traveling to the city. Let's make sure we give them a Baldurian welcome. <laughs> Damn, she got badass real quick. To be you. To split your skin. To see your skull shine in the light. Little tyrant. <sighs> Lucky for you. I harvested a whole family of living flesh in Rivington at High Sun. They will sate my blade thirst tonight. Oh, but tomorrow, and tomorrow, and tomorrow, and tomorrow, my blades will thirst again. Yeah, she was good up until her murderous intent. Beyond the campsite, the city waits in uneasy silence, one sleep away. <laughs> her outfit was cool, though. Yeah, her outfit was cool. See, now they forced me into camp. Damn it. I just got done with camp. What path lies before me? pretty very pretty <laughs> they said take a break enjoy the view that's what I'm doing see look at that view Is this like a? This song is badass. Hold on. Soft 
This is a badass song. Hold on. Is that the end of the song? It is. That was nice. And this right here is how you know Baldur's Gate earned Game of the Year. Yes. They put all that effort into it, definitely. All right, cool. That's the end of the song. Nice. Shadowheart has found a little bit of herself again. So Luna cannot take all of the credit. She may have lit the way, but it is the cleric who took this step. Now we're traveling together. I realize I don't know much about you. That speaks well of your taste. I've heard my share of bad ballads about things I never did. If you have questions, ask. Just don't expect my answers to rhyme. Uh, I think we talked about these before. We did. Yeah. Alright, who else do we have here at camp? Shadowheart was no true child of Shah, merely a captive. She must have her vengeance. Just like you would have liked it. Mm -hmm. It's a pot calling the kettle black. Well, taken from the light to be raised in darkness. Your truth is finally dawning, Shadowheart. Call her ass out. Yeah, I know, right? Light, or you can retreat back into dusk. The truth is finally dawning. Shadowheart can follow its light, or she can retreat back into dusk. Wait, hold on. Is that it? Well met. Yeah, yeah, okay. Well, I freed your ass. Granted, it'll be in six months, but now you... That's all you have to say? Fine. Anything to talk to Shadow Hard about? 
almost pleasant traveling with company. If you ignore all the less pleasant aspects. Mm. Nope. Oh my god, Carlax tail is going through the ground. It should be going like back through here. Like they're laying down here, but no, it's got it curled up going on the ground. It's a uh, she dug a hole. It's a tunnel snake. What is that? Oh, berries. Wait. That's Isabel and Aelin. Okay. Can I talk to them? Yeah, I kind of want Aelin in my party. Looking forward to a bit of rest, if I'm honest. It's been a long century. There you are. I have awaited your arrival with great anticipation. Come closer. Uh, we're close enough as it is. Uh, what is it? Feel my voice rattle your bones as I proclaim our victory. Moon Maiden Saluna, hear me. Catherick Thorne, traitor, apostle of Merkel, is dead at last. My mate, most high. Darling Isabel is safe and well. Safe and well and return to my embrace. Blessings upon the slayer of the wicked one. Um. Where's the silver light? The moon magic. The what? The hell, a whole tree just fell in the woods. What the fuck? Taking gold over a prayer. I uh, couldn't have done it without you. Where's the silver light? The moon magic. Listen to the subtle vibrations of the moon maiden thumping within your heart chambers, friend. She works her magic there. My darling Isabel says we will stay allied at your side. I am pleased to hear it. Mm, uh, I hate to break it to you, but I am not a follower of Saluna. So, yeah. I don't think my heart will thump so furiously. There's still a great deal about you I don't know. And to spend this, your newfound freedom. I am free from my bonds, but not my duty. The dead three are risen. The dead two remain. You must face them. I will help. Okay. Still don't know a great deal about you. Pray, ask, and I will tell. Hmm. Are you really Saluna's daughter? Do I not radiate with my mother's brightness, her glory? There can be no doubt. I am of her silvered flesh, her celestial womb. I'm willing to aid us in a fight against the Dead Three? How did you become trapped in the Shadowfell? <sighs> Catherick Thorne. Father of my one and only love. Enslaver of Dame Aelin. <sighs> Catherick Thorne never did trust me. Even when he worshipped the Moon Maiden. He was threatened by my love for Isabel. By her love for me. When she died... Curse the day, the hour. We each of us mourned bitterly, but Catherick's pain could be touched by no aid, no boundary. He turned to wretched Shah, the Lady of Loss, for relief, and she whispered into his ear, poisoning his mind. He and his loathsome advisor, Balthazar, lured me into the Shadowfell, claimed they'd found someone in need of my aid. There, they trapped me in their infernal cage. I was killed, murdered, made dead over and over and over by justicias of every make and kind. I was reborn, for it is my nature. And Catherick fed upon my immortality all the while. But lo, the brute is dead. And we, we live! So would your mother be willing to aid us in the battle against the Dead Three? Why, she already has. 
She has brought her sword to your side, Dame Aelin. So mighty are her wonders, her great wisdom. Together, we will set this fair land free of tyranny and murder. Hmm. I'm just gonna leave on that note. She's a little extreme. Nisarion, I'm sorry about shooting the you in the back. Close, as is Casador. Casador and his right of profane ascension. An imperial soiree, attended by devils and spawn alike. A grand ceremony to honor one exalted vampiric master. And elevate him to an unfathomable station. To place him in a position of such esteem. The world will yearn to kneel and offer their necks. It sounds as if you envy him. Uh, not a bad place to be. We need to stop him yesterday. You think we can defeat him? Are we strong enough? Of course we can. We're level 10. Huh. Huh. Hmm. Tells us if you envy him. Of course I envy him. Why wouldn't I? The problem with what Cazador has done is that he did it to me. If the time comes and I can stay one move ahead of him, I'll take his place before his blood can hit the floor. So you'd kill to take that power from him. The others bound to the ritual? Hmm. I'm not <laughs> judging. What's a hand for the wretched servants? If they're anything like me when I was enslaved, they're all but begging for death anyway. After 200 years of shit, pure shit, I think I deserve something better. Eh, is that you're safe? Freedom is not the same as power. Uh, a killer isn't worthy of respect. Uh, don't get ahead of yourself. We don't even know if that's possible. Damn right. Uh, freedom is not the same as power. Yeah, to an extent. Mm, damn right. We'll be glorious both, you and I. You'll have your day too. Let's find out more about the ritual before we waltz into Casador's front door. Agreed. If we track down my old comrades, the other spawn, we may discover more and be finely positioned for yours truly to ascend. Hmm. Don't get ahead of yourself. We don't even know if it's possible for you to usurp the ritual. We'll be useful. We'll find the other spot. Help you stop Kazor. I won't promise anything else. Um. We don't even know if you can usurp the ritual. We're going to Baldur's Gate, the city of one in a million chances, splendor and squalor. <laughs> Anything could happen. If we don't find my brethren, they'll find us, likely with bared fangs. We should get to them first. Then we can make their pretty tongues talk. Unless Cazador has changed their orders, they'll be in the dens of this town. Seeking prey. Hmm. Despite the fact that I don't like Asterion, I do like the voice acting. Um. Gale's bitch ass. Let's go. The absolute should be a thing of the past, and I with it. Yet, at the risk of angry Mr. Fervor, I'm glad it didn't come to that. Given what has come to light. Hmm. Good mood. I thought you might be more subdued after coming close to blowing up. <laughs> coming close? Shit, I didn't even bring him into the battle. He wasn't even there. You don't miss the Shadow Curse lands then? Hardly. I'm more than glad to leave that place behind. 
the elder brain, but more importantly, the crown that it wore. Even without seeing it for myself, I could sense it. Netherese magic. So pure, so complete. I doubted what I was feeling at first. Most Netherese artifacts contain only the faintest amount of their former power, the ghost of an echo of a memory. That crown was different. I can't fathom how such a wonder survived. Surely everything of its ilk was destroyed along with Netheril itself, but no matter, it exists. I must learn more of it. Back up a little. Why is this crown so important all of a sudden? That crown sits on a gargantuan elder brain bent on destroying us and everything we hold dear. Understanding its true nature might unlock the means of our victory. We need to learn more about what we saw. An artifact as powerful as that crown must have been documented somewhere. As luck would have it, we'll soon find ourselves near one of the finest book collections this side of Candlekeep, Sorcerer's Sundries. I need to go there and learn all I can. Hmm. Why would a ball during its magic shop be the first place we look? So you just want to go shopping? Nah. That's, the magic shop would have magical stuff, so that seems like a dumb question to me. I can see how it would be if somebody doesn't know anything about Baldur's Gate, though. Um... So you just want to go shopping? Yeah. Book shopping? But yes. Their collection of rare tomes is unparalleled. I mean, nethery sex are hardly commonplace, but I'm certain they'll have one or two stashed away. You'll have to forgive my eagerness, but if my suspicions prove to hold water, this could be the answer to all our problems. Okay. Yep, pet the cub. You smell nice, but I will not eat you. Painful truths have been thrust upon Shadowheart. I believe she is strong enough to endure. But her path will be easier with our support. Mm. I'm glad we have Jahira traveling with us. Do you know her from before? Only by reputation. She was present when we marched against Ketherick Thorm, but on the far end of the battle lines from where I fought. And in the chaos that ensued, well, our forces were scattered. I led some to safety, but never learned of her fate. I'm glad to hear she survived. <laughs> Though in truth, I should not be surprised. She was always said to be formidable and cunning. I could have learned much from her, no doubt. You're an arch druid. <laughs> what could you possibly have left to learn from anyone? No matter how long I live, I will always strive to remain a keen pupil. Only a fool would think he could drink in all knowledge until none is left. True. There is always more. Nature's tapestry is infinitely complex. I cannot help but wonder how she would have handled some of the challenges I faced as Archdruid. Defended the Grove. Korga. The Shadow Druids. At least now we can benefit from her presence and perhaps work to a common goal. Hmm. No, you probably. Uh, I need you by my side. Oh, God, no. Leave. All right, is that everybody? Besides Withers. Do I need to talk with her? I always talk to Carl at last.
Ok. Thou hast now a bosom companion. Take care that thou art not distracted on my quest, seeking the comforts of the flesh. Uh, excuse me? <laughs> Don't be grumpy. <laughs> I really want to make Garlag happy. It isn't about the flesh. It's about companionship. I will enjoy myself whenever I please. My love life is none of your business, skeleton. <laughs> Excuse me? Recall that in time, all becomes dust and bone. Oh, God. No. Fate spins along as it should. Dost thou require a new ally? Or mayhaps a resurrection instead? Alright, cool. Although I should respec. Because I am a warlock. I wonder what Act of the Great Old One would be like. Because now I don't I don't even use the the main reason why I did Oh god, here, let's look it up. Feet. Warlock, Fiend, Passives, Repelling Blast. No, it's, a uh, Back to the Fiend. It gives me that plus bonus. Temp HP for every time I kill somebody. The problem is... Oh yeah, I got so many reactions. And I need to switch up my Draconic Ancestry for my Sorcerer. So, because I mainly just cast fire anyway, so it doesn't matter. Uh, if only I got bonus to fire damage with my actual deal. Eh. I guess I could be cold. smothering my dark interval I can't move and take a 3d18 bet back rolls against the effect the entities have advantage saving throws have disadvantage okay I mean I'd be great if I just capture someone but yeah um Yeah. Yeah, I'll do later. Let's talk to Carlac. Poor Shadowheart. She's been jerked around so much. I want to believe the gods keep this world balanced, but sometimes. Sometimes I wonder. Uh. Nope, that's fine. Leave. I guess that's all the same stuff I talked about before. So now, I guess it's time to go to sleep. Cursed go to bed. Hands on everything. The events of the last days weigh heavily upon you. Sleep's rest is slow to come to one whose mind is so full. The Absolute is not a god, but an elder brain controlled by the Chosen of the Dead Three. They mean to use it to take control of the Sword Coast. All who carry the Tadpole are governed by the brain and by extension the Chosen. It will take but one order to transform them into an army of Mind Flayers. This would have been your fate too were it not for the Astral Prison. And the mysterious visitor inside of it. With her help, you have uncovered the cult for what it really is. A plan of conquest orchestrated by the gods of death themselves. Together, you have the power to thwart the dead three. If you follow this path to its end, the Elder Brain will not answer to the Chosen. It will answer to you. Will you liberate them from their parasites and their religious delusions? 
Or will you use the power you gain for your own purposes? I don't want it to free, to be free of this parasite. I will do what is necessary to make that happen. I will succeed, or the chosen will fail. I will dominate the world. Uh, when the moment comes, I will do what feels right. I will free everyone of this evil. I will do what feels right. Um. Oh, it's these two. It's a choice. Hmm. I would do what feels right. You will not have long to wait. All you need to do now is sleep. But sleep is not for you. Hear me. Gather. The reckoning is upon us. The city thirsts for domination. March. Joy. Me. Well, fuck. Zephyr, whatever that is. Escape to the portal before the absolute takes control. Where's the portal? Oh, it's on the other side. How many hit points I got? 71 out of 88, 69 out of 80, 74. So they're actually kind of weak. Yeah, there you go. Just the do that. Is gonna fall. Reckless? Save that. End turn. Is this the gift Sarai? Because they're coming in like monks instead of like warriors. Okay. Come here. Yeah, come in. And then off an attack? No, bite. Action surge. There you go. Piercing strike. Do it. Miss. <gasps> Tadpole scum. Are you fucking kidding me? Fight your way to the portal. I need your help. Okay, this is Shadow Heart. All right, cool. Sounds good. Mm. Spirit weapon. No, do, do spirit weapon there. Here, lacerate this one. All right, that's fine. Need to stay focused. Shadow Heart, what do you got? Um, no. How many points I got left? Twenty-four. In that case, I need to do. I can do it at level one. Yeah, that's fine. Do that. All right, cool. Run over here. Got to press on. 
That's fine. Go. Uh, in turn. Survival is all that matters. Here we go. This should be fine. What do we got? You're dead. You're in the process of dying, and okay, cool. No. No, and I miss on the first one. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> Missy step. There we go. Intern and intern. And what was that? Her voice transforming? Here, yeah, attack that one. Reckless. Uh, yeah, I go with that. And turn over there. All right, intern. Are OP as shit. Jesus fucking Christ. Now, hold on. One, two, three, four, five. Now, oh, what the fuck? And you miss. What the fuck? Of course you did. Come quickly. I can't do this without you. Oh god, it's another one that just came in. Fuck. Um Over here, right there. Uh, shield, right there. You go down, you go there, then you die back there. Now I don't have enough movement to make it to the portal, which is fine. I'm gonna missy step fucking right there. Can I click the portal? I don't have enough movement to go through the portal? What the fuck? Enter. There we go. Go. Uh. 
Asterion, what do we got? Then offhand. Yeah, go. All right, Karlak, it's go time. Does she not have a way to get over there? Go. Are you fucking kidding me? What? Whatever. Knees high. Let's spill some blood. In turn. Need your help. More are coming. Wait. Hurry, or we will all become thralls. Wait, how do I how do I get through the portal? Nope, Carl, I just died. What the fuck? That thing's not going to hold together much longer. under attack no, no, go turn base hold on I need items wait no she just needs a hand here just still alive so that's progress fucking jump exit turn base mode jump over there I can't hold them back alone. What's next, I wonder? Friend of Kenji. Wait, how? What the fuck? Do they, like, why do monks get, like, infinite attacks? What the fuck? Jesus fucking Christ. Yeah, that's gonna be kind of a waste. Um, that's gonna be kind of a waste too. Here, just shove this fucker. All right, intern, you sneak attack. I don't because I'm inefficient and not doing my shit properly. Yeah, cool, intern. How many fucking 
fucking attacks as a monk fucking gets. Jesus fucking Christ. Can I not throw anything on the top of this fucking pillow? God damn it. <laughs> there. Sorry, Ethereum. How the fuck? Wait, are they resistant to fucking fire damage? No, how the fuck did it do to zero? Oh, because they have monks. They're fucking high evasion and whatever. Whatever. There, and turn. And then they broke concentration on fucking spirit guardians. God damn it. Where was my last fucking save? Auto save. Worms. Lockout. Okay. Can't control dad. Whose fucking turn is it? My faith will protect me. Oh, call upon a deity in your moment of greatest need. Once they interfere would never do this matter do so in this matter again once in their adventure what the fuck uh 18 yeah let's go with that one cool and let's do nope 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 cool all right and turn are you fucking kidding me Jesus fucking Christ. Oh my God. Jesus. Monks are OP as shit at higher levels, like ridiculously OP. Wait, is this? I got to do everything I did at the fucking camp again. Hold on, God These damn it! Boots have seen everything. All right. I'm here. Help me! I'm under attack. What's next? What a charmer.
I mean, how many you got left? That one. That one. Um. Sterion. Oh, Carlac. Run over to this one. There you go. Sterion. You come over here. Right there. Boom. To do max damage against that one. Cool. End your turn. Carlac, you're up. Let's do this more strategically. Attack. And attack. Reckless. Do not react. Motherfucker. Alright. Go ahead and rage and turn. Come here. You. Wisdom. Wait, hold on. What is their weakest? No, wisdom is like their highest. Fuck, their stats are OP as shit. What the hell? They have no weakness. God damn. Okay, um. That shit. Weakness is just there on the damn thing, so. There it go. No, not a first level spell slot. Fuck. No, what are you doing? <sighs> are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> are you are you fucking kidding me? Are you supposed to do Eldritch Blast? What the fuck are you doing melee attacking? Okay. Uh, Shadow Heart. Melee attack. That one. Divine Strikes. And then do it again. Alright, cool. Enter. Alright, Asterion, finish this goddamn bitch. No. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. In turn. Push my luck again. Eldrick Blast. Dear God. No. And no. It's not over. Come to the skull. Did they not have anything? Oh, these things are useless. With haste. Oof. What do we got to collect? All right, jump. Hurry. I can't hold them back alone. It's not over. Come to the skull. I know. Might be useful. Should get started. Mind flare fighting him. Oh, what the hell? Oh, shit. I'm 
Mind Flayer. The Gith Yankee is the source of our protection against the Absolute. I must subdue him, or everything we've worked towards is lost. Don't let my form deceive you. I am the one that's been protecting you. I am the one that came to you in your dreams. Help me. Die, monster. Prove to me that you are who you say. You saved a child from a viper back in the druid's grove. You saved the Asima night soul from her soul cage. You let me live last time you were here, though it brought Black Earth's wrath upon you. Your continued existence as yourself and not a mind flayer should be all. the mind flayer's thoughts yes guidance okay fingers crossed i do have inspiration just in case yes i can read the mind flayer's thoughts dirty 20. despite your best attempts to be subtle the mind flayer's awareness is everywhere you blunder in its presence like a walk pup learning to walk you must be joking I am telling you my thoughts directly into your head. But if you insist on taking a look for yourself, be my guest. Nothing in your colorful existence to date could have prepared you for this. As the horror subsides, you are left with only and thought you must do whatever you can to subdue the Githyanki. Happy? Now, join me. Fight! Join my flitter's fight. But I have to. Together, He's the only thing keeping me alive. We can turn the tide. <laughs> Okay, so who's up? Barlack? In position. Wait, are they resistant to any damage type? Psychic resistance, of course they are. All right, cool. Let's smite first attack. And then... God damn, how many hit points did I have? Fuck, attack again, go. Reckless. Hey. Yeah, do worry about the blessing. And I guess that's it. Jesus Christ. Destroy the Alright, who's this? Asterion? Can I not get down there? Uh, here, I'm gonna have to use my bonus action then. Yeah, go. There. It's 
stun, and he's happy. Go. Perfect. Action search. Let's go. All right. Let's go again. And go. All right. Fine. Intern. I guess. Can I climb up somewhere? Can I get to the high ground? Dead Kitty Yankee. Here. Wait, am I concentrating on something? No, I broke my concentration. Okay, that's fine. Here. Was, um, there. It doesn't matter. There's that. Here. And then we're going to Eldrick Blast our way through every damn thing. One, two, three. Okay. Let's go right there. All right, Anton. Right here. Um, I don't really have much for AOE because everything's not stacking up. Can we hold planar binding? Nah, let's uh, spirit weapon. Get the bonus action out of the way. Wait, no, I need to heal right quick. On everybody. Now that's good. Okay. Uh, maintain concentration on bless. That'll be nice. Uh, do one, two, and then myself. For Shadow Heart. And that'll be it for now. Yes, running. Should I do bear heart rage? Yes, of course, rage. I should be raging. All right, cool. Main hand. Go. And do it again. All right, it's going to be in turn. Alright, Asterion, you're up. Here, sneak attack on this fucker. Then as a bonus action, second win. No, he's at full health. Why would I do that? No. Yeah, that's right. Go ahead and hit another one. Alright, enter. Here we go. Alright, reapply hex. Uh, this one? No. No. Uh, no. Yeah, let's make the last one a crit, just in case. Okay. And hide behind Shadow Heart. That's fine. Enter. What does she have over there? God, she's almost dead. Um. Fifth level spells. I don't have anything I need to do that's that powerful, so. No. Let me just go. Guiding bolt? 
Let's do that at fourth level. Wait, no, hold on. Aid at fifth level. Go. There we go. And go with Massey Lord. Third level. Go with that. Here we go. And turn. Reckless, of course. I mean, why would you not do reckless? Uh, yes, another one here. But no, oh, that's right. They can't be damaged by missile attacks. Can I get closer? Can I attack him? Oh, Infernal Binding. Okay, enter. God damn. And now she's not concentrating anymore because she's been knocked prone. You bitch. Um, yeah, sure. Let's go over here. Sneak attack. Let's play. Off hand attack to. I mean, there's nothing else. Oh, do I have to free him? The rock resists all attempts to shatter it. Um, can I not? No, stop. No, I just want to examine the goddamn thing. What the fuck? When I go, here you do that, Carlac. All right, can I smack it, main hand? No. Okay, I guess not. Breathing, despite everything. Another step forward. I can't examine it. Hold on. The rock resists all attempts to shatter it. Hmm. Oh well. Wait, can I do range sneak attack on him? Yes. Did an off hand attack. Go. And that's it. End turn. Here, let's go boom, boom, and boom. Is that Orpheus? Thank you. That was too close. Don't look at me like that. I am a mind flayer. Yes. Without me. You would be a slave to the absolute. I agree. Of all the things to be indebted to, a bloody mind flayer. Ask again, who are you? And I'm going to need a name this time. Uh, I think if you saved me. I always suspected you were a mind flayer. Mm, 
You were in the prism all this time? Why did you deceive me? Where are the other version of you? Uh, I ask again, who are you? And I'm going to need a name this time. You may call me the Emperor. Oh, God. An adventurer. I came from Baldur's Gate. Though I was never one to be constrained by circumstance. I longed for more. That longing brought me to Moonrise Towers on a search for treasure. To a colony of Mind Flayers who caught me. Changed me into what I am now. Oh god, not a table again. Okay, cool. The, elder brain, the one you know as the absolute. I was a thrall like any other, but I was fortunate. I broke free and started a new life in my old city. I sustained myself on criminals. Unglamorous, but there are plenty of them. Rarely missed. And they fueled me when I did my work. I had the good fortune to meet Duke Stillmane. We formed a partnership, and through her, I became the governing force behind the Knights of the Shield, the largest mercantile operation in Baldur's Gate. People referred to me as the Emperor. Such was my influence, though of course they had no idea what I really was. My needs were sated. I was happy for a while. Until my true nature was discovered by the tyrant himself, Lord Gortash. He tore me from my home and brought me back to the brain where I became a slave once again. A slave he continued to call the Emperor. The name was intended as a slight to remind me of the heights from which I fell. But I have grown fond of it. It encapsulates well who I've become. Lord Gortash was one of the chosen in the colony. Uh, do you have to eat criminals' brains? Mm. Did you have to eat? Uh, so are you telling me what this battle was about? Are you so are you going to tell me what this battle was about? How did you end up in here? Githyank in his fear. Who is it? Are you gonna tell me what this battle is about? We fought to tame Prince Orpheus, the son of Gith herself. His power has been the source of your continued protection against the voice of the Absolute. The power to disrupt hive mind communication. It is the same power that enabled Orpheus' his mother to bring about the fall of the Illithid Empire eons ago. A power she passed on to him, and that I leveraged for you. When Orpheus' his mother left, a usurper took her place. Vlakith declared herself queen of the Githyanki. Vlakith wanted his power, but Orpheus rose against her, and so she sealed him and his honor guard within this prison. Bound by infernal chains, Orpheus could never leave. Bound by duty, his guard never would. They were close to breaking my hold on that prince. And if they had succeeded, we would be lost. I am relieved. You have embraced your potential enough that you could help me eliminate them. Alone, Orpheus will be much easier to control. Hmm. Were you imprisoned here too? Was it you or Orpheus that if Black had wanted us to kill when she ordered us inside the prison? Cortash and the other chosen to find out about the Astral Prison. Hmm. Was it you or Orpheus that Black had wanted us to kill before she ordered us inside the prison? Most certainly Orpheus. He is a threat to her reign. Some Githyankis still revere him in defiance of their teachings. Blackith was safe as long as they believed him to be dead. But as you can see, he is very much alive. Hmm. She kept him this way because she was reluctant to eradicate such power. Power that she might one day wish to take from him. 
If the Githyanki ever find out what she has done, there will be civil war. Blacketh will be finished. Hmm, you were in prison here too? No. Gorthaus sent me on a mission to retrieve the Astral Prison. I was one of many, but the first to find it. How Gorthash or the other Chosen learned of its existence, I do not know. Hmm. The moment I found it, I felt a change. My free will returning. I followed the feeling inside and found Orpheus. I realized what the prism was for. Containment. While my body was within the prism's bounds, my mind was free. I could resist the Elder Brain, the Chosen. Better yet, I could plan to overthrow them. All I needed to do was subdue Orpheus and find allies in the outer world. You. Hmm. Could we kill Orpheus and seize his power? What happens if we free Orpheus? That would be a terrible idea. The moment he is free, he will attack you. Your only defense would be to kill him. And in so doing, you would doom us both. Even though he is subdued, you feel Orpheus's revulsion. A pulsing hatred that cannot be contained. The Emperor is telling the truth. To him, you are just another wretched illithid. You carry a tadpole. As far as Orpheus is concerned, you are already a lithid, a sworn enemy, just like me. The more I talk to you, the less you seem like a mind flare. That's because he's independent. Mm, I'm nothing like you. I'm no illithid, never will be. We are alike in other ways, too. I'm glad you think so. I agree. But there is one thing that you have that I do not. My original body was destroyed when I transformed. Yours continues to limit you. As an Alithid, I have far surpassed who I ever was before. You too should embrace this change. Oh, I don't know if I should do that yet. Uh... To avoid becoming a mind flayer, I thought you agreed to protect me. <laughs> Why do you say that? I believe we'll have a better chance of defeating the Elder Brain if you embrace your latent illithid potential. I've been studying you for a while now. I believe I can trigger the next stage of your tadpole's life cycle while continuing to preserve your independence. You have seen what I can do. Imagine yourself with the same strength, the same intelligence, the same devastating beauty. Uh, if you let me, okay. I can evolve you. Hmm. If you can evolve me, why can't you stop Ceramorphosis altogether? Hmm, what, what would that entail? You will be able to do things you never thought were possible. Here's Pokemon. <laughs> there will be physical alterations, of course, but only partial. You will retain most of your current form. And you will soon see that the benefits outweigh any perceived loss. you can evolve me, why can't you stop Ceramorphosis? The answer is twofold. One, I can, but it would kill you, as I told you before. Okay. Two, why would I? You have done well with the limited form you have, but you would do far better as an illithid. So, do you wish to evolve or not? I have no idea how this is going to affect my party. So, that said, I'm going to lay down a quick save in the middle of the conversation here. Just in case. 
Just in case. Fingers crossed. Do it. I like to evolve. Because she would. She would evolve. I just don't want to lose my allies because these three are great. Well, suddenly brave of you. I'll say that much. You continue to surprise me. Your mind is truly something special. Now, hold out your hand. Do as he says. It wants to evolve, but it cannot do so alone. It must commune with another. No, I won't do it. What is what is it? What a is it? Pole, nurtured by the psionic energy of the astral plane, cocooned here for millennia, it has become extraordinary. Hmm. Probe the temple's intentions. Uh, what are the... Oh, fuck. Hold on. I got inspiration. Hmm. Yep, roll again. Fifteen. Thank goodness gracious. The tadpole screams for growth with painful intensity. It has been starved of life, of purpose. It welcomes your probing like a void waiting to be filled. If you let it, it will evolve you, just as the Emperor said. Mm. Open your mind to the tadpole. A coldness seeps through your veins as the tadpole awakens. It's yearning almost unbearable. Your mind a veritable feast. The tadpole's essence courses through you. Where it touches, your flesh, glands, organs contract and flood with pure thought. You feel different. Your body has never felt more connected. Your mind present in every flex of a joint or muscle. You are exquisite. When your allies see what you can do, I hope you encourage them to try it for themselves. But we mustn't lose focus. We need to resume our journey. You heard the Chosen. The Brain has gone to the city, and the army marches to follow. We must not let them reach it. We must find the Brain, and bring it under our control. Oof. Half Illithid. You have embraced Ceramorphosis and become half Illithid. You can now unlock even more powerful psionics. Oof, I unlocked four. Okay. Entry updates available. Um, Astral Touch Tadpole. Oh, wait. Re I guess it gave me four tadpoles? What did they oh, wait, unlock the outer edge. Okay, cool. And it gave me fly by default. Awesome. Hold on. Okay, what are these abilities over here? I have to unlock these here to get this. Absorb intellect. Both intellects lowering, lowering their intelligence by one by turning and healing your wounds for five turns. Okay. Recast. You have discovered a marvelous adaptability within yourself. Spell slots, charges, and similar resources cost for your next action or spell are removed. Refreshes after a long rest. Um, the costs are removed. Oh, that's amazing. Um, yeah, maybe not that one there, but this one. I've got to get this one here. So that give me um, one, two, three more to get. Okay. What is this? 
a mind sanctuary. Sculpt a magical nexus that allows those within to take actions and bonus actions interchangeably. Oh. Okay, hold on. Before I continue reading this, I've got to step away right quick. I'm going to run to the restroom. I will be right back, chat. Can you be patient with me? I'll be right there. All right. All right, chat, I am back from outer space. Oof. Yeah, went to the local Asian market. I got these things here. I don't know how it looks on chat. But, uh, boop, 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 yep. I don't even know. What Digimon that is, it's on it. But it's like a, it's a tarot milk tea. Or taro, taro, however you want to say it. Uh, it tastes like cereal milk to me. So, bottoms up. Yep, it's taro. Milk tea. Mm hmm. All right, where was I? Did I read this one? Mind Blast. Oh, possibly stun targets? Oh, that is great. Uh, once per long rest, okay. Black Hole. 
heard a point of intense gravity at the pulls all nearby enemies and possibly slows them. Mm -hmm. Hell yes, I'm getting that one. Psionic dominance. When an enemy within 60 feet targets you with a spell of a level that is lower than or equal to your proficiency bonus, you can use your reactions to nullify the spell. Okay, so that gives me an extra counter spell. That's awesome. Okay, illithid expertise. You have deepened your sense of self, gaining expertise in persuasion, deception, and intimidation checks. Bro, what? Hold on. Fracture Psyche. Invade a target's mind and disrupt its defenses. The target's armor class is reduced by one. Now that's for five turns. Bro, that's OP as shit. Hold on. Class action. Transform into a displacer beast and can displace itself at enemies and has 85 hit points until long rest. What? Absorb intellect, free cast. That means I would need to get this one. Hold on. There are other more potent shit. Hold on. Black hole, of course. Get it. This one here helps out in social situations. Give me that. That's cool. Um, I do want to get all of these. Mind Blast. Chronicle Wave of Psychic Energy and possibly Stun Targets. Psionic Dominance. Sixty feet targets you with a spell of a level that is lower than your proficiency bonus. What is my proficiency bonus? Is it four right now? Three or four? So if it's a fourth level spell or lower, I can nullify the spell like a counter spell. That's amazing. Right. Go. Okay. What does displace mean? You have the attributes of displacer beast, but maintain your intelligence, wisdom, and charisma scores. When your displacer beats four and drops to zero hit points, you revert to your original four until long rest. Displace. Teleport yourself and target to a nearby location, shredding the target's mind and leaving behind an illusory copy of yourself. Okay. It has 85 hit points. That actually sounds badass. Um, I don't know. Hold on. Mine. Mine Sanctuary. Mine Blast. Yeah, let's take Mine Blast. That means I would need to get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven more tadpoles. Okay, cool. Can I move this to like right there? I can. And then just drop that off. No, get rid of it. 
Oh ja. Can we can we get rid of it? Go. No, I don't want to do that. What is that? That scroll of aid? No, I don't want to get a scroll of aid. Hold on. Uh, yeah, move this right there. Fly. I can now fly. That is amazing. All right, enter the portal, enter the material plane. Leave the astral plane. No, hold on. That's right, I can explore over here. What's over here? Can I get stuff? Gods are watching me. Inscribe, get the Yankee slate. Wish I had a bag of holding. Symbolic drawing etched over forgotten text. Two figures, one an opposing female at a regal aspect, and the other a devil. His face twisted a wry charm. With the Rye Charm, their hands meet in exchange of an artifact, the Astral Prison. Oh. Ouch. Here? Intellect of our... Boots of uninhibited Cuchiago. Oh, there you go. Boom. Where is the Emperor at? Yes. Um, yeah, get all these ingredients here. There he goes. Cloud kill. Superior arcane of cultivation, wizard bane oil, superior healing. That gets Yankee, Chasm Reaper. Uh, what is this? Pain death. Oh lord. Will you hold still? There, pick up, pick up the Chasm Creeper. Pick up the Void Bulb. Grab the into intellect devour. Okay, cool. There ain't nothing in it. Wait, is there a way to get up there? Hold on. Can I just fly?
can just fly. That's awesome. Okay, well that's all of that. Divine Bone Shard, here, take it, pick it up. Um, here, fly. Over here. Chasm Creeper. There is a chest over there. Can I get over there? Take all, take all. Is there anything over here? Take all. Inscribe Githyanki Slate. Mm. All right, the slate is scar with the faded symbol is carved over with the drawings. It depicts an army training. Their commander stands proudly at the center. His face marked with scar, his eyes burning with bright passion high above the, the uh, calmer streaks, the calmest streaks across the sky. <laughs> Broke a chill, caustic bulb, couple of pikes. Void bulb. Dead get the Yankee. There you go. No, oh, those two are stuck down there. Okay. Yeah, take all. Divine Bone Shield. Broken Club. Death get the, dead get the Yankee. Uh, what is this? Scroll of Globe of Invulnerability creatures and objects inside uh, immune to all damage. Nice. Okay, Chasm Creeper. Oh, there's a chest right there behind you. Whenever you first, like, spawn. And there is more up here, of course. I was about to say, where is everything? I forgot we're inside the Austral prison, so there's not really much else. Sword, intellect devour, take. There's just so much loot around here. And Scrythe, Gith Yankee. Slate. The image on this slate has been carved 
with such intensity that it almost pierces the slate itself. Depictions of spells and weapons frame a lonely, sensual figure, his head bowed, his arms outstretched, chained between two rocks. Okay. Nope. Uh, jump. Go. Hope this ends well. Okay, so there is a chest over here I need to get to. Okay. I get over there. Is it, can I get over there? Market is too far. What if I went over here? There we go. That or like you take that. Okay, cool. Take off. No, oh, what do you want, Garlic? Gods, a mind flayer has been getting their tentacles all over our dreams this whole time. I'm really not sure about putting any trust at all in this thing. It's already shown itself a liar. Can you blame it, though? I've got my eyes on the Emperor, and Karlak doesn't blink. <laughs> okay, can I fly? All right, let's go. Get over here? Can I get down here? Oh, what the hell? Uh, Asterion, what the hell are you doing? Get over here now. I'm done in here. Oh no, everybody's zombies. They came back alive just to die. <sighs> Alright, quick save again. So I have to do all that running around. And then go through the plane. Oh, you want to leave the astral plane? Yes, I do. All right, cool. I'm now over encumbered. Serious artifact. Okay, cool. Move, move out of the way. All right. Evolving you or another illithid infected companion into a new, more physically powerful being. 
Schatten. That's medium armor here. You wear that. Mm, telekinesis? That might be good on him. Water sparkers, boots uninhibited, itch. Kushiago. Kush. Kushigo. Kushiago. I don't know why I kept adding the extra, extra letter in there. Additional damage equal to their wisdom modifier with unarmed strikes. Yeah, it'd be great if I was a monk. But I'm not a monk. Circlet, put that there. Yeah. No, uh, yeah, there. Yankee longsword, put that there. Saloon spear of night. Moonbeam, moon moat. That's, I think, moon moat's dancing lights. It has the same icon. With some saving throws and perception checks. Dear Lord. Okay, I'm gonna get that to a shadow heart. But that's all I can do. Is that it? Nope. I'm gonna take, uh, go. I'm gonna go talk to what's her name. Her name being uh, Lizelle. Where's Shahira? Shahira's gone. Will's gone. Oh, is it because of uh, all the events that happened in the middle of the night? No, oh, all of these folks are empty. Of course they are. Already feeling better. Okay, yeah, it's because of the events. Darling? has offered us a special tap pool. We'll become partial mind flayers, but we'll get great powers in turn. Um, leave. Okay, I'm gonna finish up this night. <sighs> Please reset all my spell slots. Please, that's what I need. Spell slot reset. Okay, cool. It reset everything. Good. Now Lazel wants to talk. Everybody wants to talk now. All right, let's go. Let's go humor them. Your parasite communes with Lazel's. Her heart races as she learns of the events inside the astral prison. Orpheus, Gith's only son. He lives. It is not the Gaith visitor that Vlakith would destroy and Voss would set free. It is Orpheus, the blood of the mother, the prince of the comet. The blood of the mother. Who is he exactly? A mighty powerful prince. If he can block out an illithid hive mind, what makes Orpheus such a threat to Vlakith? Um, no matter who is he exactly. Listen close. The Empress spoke only in half truth. For you to know the tale of Orpheus, you must know the tale of Gith and of Vlakith. Long ago, when we rose up against our Gith slavers, 
Mother Gith made for the Hells to secure an alliance with the Archdevil Tiamat. Tiamat gifted the Githyanki our red dragons. Gith remained in the Hells, and Tiamat's envoy proclaimed Vlakith our ruler. The first Vlakith of many. It is Vlakith 157 whom my people now call Queen. Hmm. 157. That's a lot of Vlakiths. How does Orpheus fit in? Orpheus was, is, Gith's only son. He led his mother's own honor guard in a coup against Vlakith I. It was Kithrak Voss himself who slayed the prince in vicious battle, or so the Varshis teach us. Yet the prince of the comet's been with us, subdued by that repugnant illithid. Should Orpheus go free, he would tear Vlakith's empire to pieces and build new glory from the scraps. Mm, then Voss was right. Orpheus is the seed of Vlakith's demise. I agree. The problem is we're stuck in this situation where I can't. I can't, at least not until things are done. Then Voss was right. Orpheus is the seed of Vlakith's demise. Just one Gith Yankee. Is he really all that dangerous to Vlakith? Yeah, because he'll cause half the fucking people to rebel. And Voss was right. The seed and the sower. Every word Voss spoke, he spoke true. Orpheus is the living proof of the Queen's lies and the living weapon that conquered our Gaith slavers. One word from his lips and the people would doubt. Two words and they would rage. Three words and they would bow to the true heir. If the Githyank here to be free, the Prince of the Comet must lead the way. There's a problem. Talk about Orpheus. Uh, we have making use of the Tapple's powers. Emperor Astral's Tapple promising exceptional power. No, uh, I want to talk to you about what Orpheus. About him? Prince of the Comet, keep Orpheus alive all those millennia ago. Who were the hostile Gith Yankee in the prison? Um, what's he called, the Prince of the Comet? The historical slates describe Orpheus as a fearsome, terrible creature, powerful beyond measure, and enthralled by the Gaith. So mad with power, he'd smash through the Githyanki Empire and deliver the shards to his illithid masters. And glowing with such psionic force that he and his red dragon blazed a trail through the skies. A lethal comet careening towards my people. Lies, of course. Vlakith spread a false image of Orpheus as monstrous betrayer, and her knights as the butchers who sliced him through. She was right to fear him, I'll grant her that. So great is the comet, it could shatter her reign. Uh, I kind of doze out there. Did she answer the question? I don't, I don't know. It's alive all, this, all those millennia ago. The Emperor may be loathsome, but it's right. Orpheus can disrupt a gay hive mind. A talent like that makes the prince a powerful shield and a powerful weapon. Why destroy a weapon like that when you can contain it in a relic and keep it for yourself? Wait, why would she want him dead if he's so valuable alive? A weapon is only an asset for as long as it isn't pointed at you. The means of Vlakith's own end has been ripped away from her. Better to have Orpheus killed than to risk his escape. Better to risk the rise of Illithids than let the Prince of the Comet deny her the godhood she craves. Hmm. Who were those hostile Githyanki in prison? Orpheus is honor guard, loyal to the end. Trapped by Vlakith in the same prism holding their noble prince, fruitlessly hacking at the sphere that contains him. They see us as Gaith, tadpoled husks in the Emperor's thrall. I regret their deaths, but I pledge to live as they perished, 
in the service of Gith's son. That's all that matters. Hmm. Leave. Will, do you get anything? Love Shadowheart's new look. Softer, less severe. It suits her. No, believe. Shadowheart. Wait, what happened? So, there's been a mind flayer inside the artifact or astral prism the whole time we've had it. Sounds like utter madness, even though I've seen it with my own eyes. The more I learn, the less I understand just why I was sent to retrieve that thing. But it matters little now. I do not serve Shah anymore, nor the Mother Superior. The prism is no longer my mission. Saving my parents is. But I digress. Did you want something? Uh, special tap. Uh, no, leave. Okay, good. There's Shahira. Uh, she doesn't want to talk about anything, so that's fine. Who else is down here? Nobody else wants to talk about anything? Anything at all? Nobody else wants to... Here, I probably gotta go down here. <sighs> Alright, let me summon... Imp. Okay. Okay then, let's see here, what? Transfuse health. I mean, that might come useful in a pinch, maybe. Uh, in the meantime, though, nobody wants to talk. Does Scarlet want to say anything? God, Shadowheart looks like a stack of gold. <laughs> Never thought I could get so excited about someone's forehead, but here we are. So about the tapple powers. Emperor's offered a special tapple about our relationship. It's been a while since we connected like we once did. Yeah, I had the same thought. <laughs> so much has happened between then and now. Maybe we just got a little caught up in it all. But I'm not going anywhere. I've got plans for the future, you know, and they involve you. No, I'll spank you very hard. <gasps> Where's Withers? <gasps> Withers is gone. Oh, no, he's not gone. He's there. Okay, cool. Now I can leave camp. Okay. Leave camp. What the fuck just happened? I leave camp and everything fucking explodes. What the hell? Why is everybody screaming now? Mm, city awaits. Leave Act 2. Baldur's Gate is just over the horizon. Nice. Finally made it to Act 3 officially. Hmm. must find where Gortash and Orin have established themselves and take their nether stones. Yep. Already know. Well, well, well ahead of you, sir. All right, cool. Um, I need aid. Fifth level. Don't stop me yet. All right, cool. Uh, elixirs? Well, can I? Well, well. Can I make shit? 
elixir of universal resistance. What the fuck is that? Does that mean what I think it means? Sublimate. Pegasus feathers and divine miasma. I shall craft one. Unless, what else is divine miasma used for? Yeah, I've only got one sublimate, so. But unless, I don't have work bangs. Elixir of the Colossus. Chasm Creeper. Muddy Goo. Grenades, coatings. Except for like Wizard's Bane oil, coatings don't really have much to do with me. I don't need those either, so. What do I got for potions? An antidote? Yeah, I don't really need that. Hold on. Universal resistance. I want to craft one. And Elixir of the Colossus, I'll craft one more of those. I mean, maybe? Suspensions. Yeah, that was fine. Elixir of Universal Resistance. Resistance to all damage. That actually might be great for her. Alright, I'm saving that elixir. I'm going to have her take this elixir of Colossus. Additional 1d4 damage, gain advantage on strength checks and saves. All right, cool. Never a dull moment. What do I have? Type. Wizard's Bane oil. I'm going to give that to him. Elixir. Fire resistance, necrotic, colossus, sea invisibility, tiefling's vice, universal resistance, battle mage power, arc skin, dark vision. Ooh, yeah, I don't need any of that. I can't slow down. The city is close now. My former peers will be watching, no doubt, waiting for my return. We should do what we can to find them. What they know could help us. Mm. All right, cool. Well, here we go. Hell yeah. All right, what's in Don't this backpack? Take that. You, what's in this backpack? Nothing. Oh, moldy cheese. I can't find my mum. Oh, you're lucky you're a kid. Um, what's your name? Jenna. Uh, my cat is Grub. He's shy. I'm not. I can my tell. My mum is called Emery. She went to go get some herbs for her spots. She was sick, and she was supposed to come back the same day. That was last ten day, though. Hmm. 
Here's here. Take a few coin. Uh, you must be hungry. Take some food. Let's go find a card. Maybe they'll be able to help you. It sounds like your mom is probably dead. Um, you must be hungry. Take some food. Let's go find a guard. They'll be able to help you. Guards blow like petards. They don't help us. Hmm. You must be hungry. Here, take some food. Only wow. because it's a kid. Thanks. My mom would like this. She's the best cook in the world. And she taught me too. I'll, um, I'll look for her. I think she'll probably come soon. Thanks a lot. Start walking right now. Oh, Rogue's Morsel. Hold on. Uh, get oh, the mushroom. God damn, how many folks are over here? Really there now. You can see the city. Up on the hill. Wait. I pulls up inventory. And Ian pulls up inventory. Okay. You're going to hire all the refugees. Just like that. I know it's all one, but you'll be in a big, cozy bed soon enough. You have everything you want for supper. All the games your tummy can handle. <sighs> Can't talk. I'm sorry. The little one needs all of my attention. Okay. Do you know where we're going? What kind of inn is it? Will there be feather beds? Mm, okay, what's over there? Oh my god. I see it. It's up there and we're down here. There is so much to explore around here. What the hell? Oh my god. I'm overwhelmed. I don't know where to go. Inside. Don't be scared. So the city's that way. Jesus Christ. I just don't know where to go. Um anything you want for supper. All the treats your tummy can handle. Alright, let's go over here. Turn back, citizen. No passage in this direction. Don't tell me where I can and can't go. It's my job to do exactly that. If you intend to spend any time in Baldur's Gate, you best learn some respect for the Flaming Fist. And trust me, you don't want to go out there. The cultists assaulted the gate, armed to the teeth trying to break in. They nearly had it too, before the Steel Watch intervened. Steel Watch? Is that some sort of fancy new rank? Of City Watchman? <laughs> a little more than that. You'll see for yourself soon enough if you head to the city. The Steel Watch. That's implemented by Gortash. So of course they held him back because it was all a, a ruse. It was an elaborate ruse, I tell you, chat. It was a ruse. What's in here? I come here for loot. Well, no, maybe not. Let's see what this does. 